Hi, I'm Kurt Ossian. This is your Move of the Week. Last week's episode was doing the last regard with a little, little roll through Oma Plaza attack. And then this week, Jake will show you how to get rid of the hooks and pass it. I'm gonna look to catch the tail of the of the gi here, right? Now, whenever I'm gonna make a grip on this pants, whenever I'm in like these kind of situations, spider guard or anything, I like to start walking backwards, right? Just to get like a low center of gravity. If I'm up high, it's more chances of getting elevated, right? So my back straight, I start to move back. Now I'm gonna take a half step and I'm gonna put my knee right behind there and I'm gonna break the grip right behind the calf. Now as I pummel, I'm gonna grab on the inside of the pants. That way I staple to the floor. If I grab on the outside, he just breathes bicep hooks me. Yeah, so go back. When I get here, I get on the inside and I control now. Now look at my, my base is gonna drop low again and I'm gonna get my shoulder really low. And it's important that my elbow stays flared open because I don't wanna get almost blocked here. So when I get here, I get really low and I start to change the pressure here. Now I can come through. Oh my nuts. What? My nuts. <laughs> the lasso in, bicep hook. Start to walk backwards, step to the side bolt, break the grip, pummel inside, drop the weight low, start coming around. Look, as soon as he cleared, look, I just drive my head towards the inside of his, um, like the top of his quad. The, the more space I have away from his head, if I try to jump here, there's too much space and he regards. So when I come around here, I'm gonna jump my head right to close the space. Is that good or one more? That's awesome. One more. Okay. Right there, Get the hook in. I try to find the tail. Yeah, that's the fight here. What the hell are you doing? Mason. Walk. Oh, Walk backwards. Step to the side. Boom. Break the grip. Side control. Drop low. Start to walk around. Boom. Trap. And pass. And that's your move of the week. Part two of the lasso and then the passing of the lasso. If you'd like to have us to your town for mayhem and jujitsu, get a hold of me at Kurt at KurtOceaner.com or uh, call the Academy, fuck ISIS, and uh, anything else? All right. Mason, you're deep shit. Go train. Hey, what's up? Uh, my name's Nick Green. This is gonna be my dance move of the week. Uh, it's been a while, but um, I found a move that I think is pretty straightforward, pretty easy, and that uh, pretty much anyone can do. Uh, what I'm gonna show, show is coffee grinders. So coffee grinders is literally what it sounds like. It's like when you when you do coffee grounds and it grinds, it goes like in a circle. So for coffee grinders, pretty much going all fours. And what you want to do is you're gonna swipe your foot across and then move your hand so that you can clear it. So here like this and then you just do it back and forth over and over so to make sure like it's a little easier you can actually put weight on your knee so when you're clearing your hands put your weight on your knee lift your leg up straight you clear here plant plant and then you do another so here here and you just push off your knee and then land again um, you can also get off your knee and do it that way so that it just looks like this and you can, you can also connect them together so you're not stopping, it's just continuous. It's also a very good exercise. You can do it the other leg, this way. You can also do it the opposite direction, so this way. And then so, you can do this side, this side, you can do both directions. So in break dancing, it doesn't look so basic, but you can kind of make it look a little bit more flashy, like if you're dancing and just go.
like that. So the basic part is the copy grinder, but you can do variations both directions, both legs. It's a little piece of break dancing that gets incorporated into your six step um, on the floor. So anyways, practice your copy grinders. It's a good workout. It's a good variation, your six step and uh, go dance.